All right, this is more, more Walmart clearance stuff. What I got here, we're calling it a sits in spotlight, but you can use these as um, fog lights. This is 950 lumens. Oh, they can do 12 to 24 volt. That's pretty cool. Whatever, IP6 or whatever, blah, 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 blah. Um, I'm not sure what LEDs are in here, but I do know that they are pretty bright. High-intensity LED bulbs. Doesn't say what kind of LEDs they are, but these are... Walmart is getting rid of the Auto Drive brand, and they're replacing with something else, so all your stores... They're now 50% off. They're blowing these out of the stores. See, this was Tel 228. They're getting blown out of the store. What does it say, 15 under it? That's stupid. So, um, yeah. They have these exact same lights at Trucks Tractor Supply. Tractor Supply, but the, the Tractor Supply one comes with two. You get two lights in there, and I think they're 30, or they might be 40 or something like that, and uh, a year ago or more, they were on clearance for like 25 or something like that, and I had bought them. Um, so this was cool. Got these for backups or whatever. So what you come with, you come with your mountain hardware, the LED light, and it's got the, the DT plug. Your standard DT plug. Um, it comes with your mounting hardware, which is going to be a bracket. I really don't need to take it out of there. Looks like there's a, a rubber piece. What's that rubber for? I don't know. Whatever. So it comes with mounting hardware, which is screws. Um, Where is it mounting to? Shit. How does it screw to it? Something's missing. Is there something missing? Huh. Alright. I'm missing something. I forget how this mounts. Where's the part it mounts to? <clears throat> Hopefully nothing's missing out of this bag. There they are. There's the holes. Okay. And the holes are right there. That's where these these screws go into. That's what the washers. Oh, the hole goes down into there. Okay. So your nut's going to be into there. These are lock screws. That's under my hand there. All right. And then I guess for, for jumping around, they have a rubber grommet for when this goes down through here and that locks that, that two there that locks that nut, nut there. <clears throat> I mean, it could go either way. You could have this nut. This is not a lock nut, but it has a lock washer. All right. So these are going to go in through there like that and then have a screw and then you have your allen wrench to fix that in there and I don't like losing stuff so it would be nice if the company did this so you don't lose stuff you know so stuff always stays with it but then you'd have to hire more more kids Put the stuff together. 
Anyway, so I'm wasting a lot of time here. And you know what? Oh well. That's what I'm saying. Oh well. Alright. So, that's how that mounts. That mounts to those two holes there. And that goes in there. And this has a DT connector. Um, so in order to hook up these lights. I believe the ones from Tractor Supply actually come with the other end. They come the other the other connector, and then you have to splice the wires to it. So you're not totally screwed like this. This has no connector. I think that's normal. I don't believe it's missing. I mean, there's no directions in this thing. I don't believe. I'm pretty sure that's normal. It doesn't come with it. This brand doesn't give you. So anyway, here's the light. And let's see how bright it is. I just happen to have a harness here, which I just did a video on. Let's show this harness. This is clearance $9, as we saw. And the harness, if you check the harness, I'll show you the UPC so you can go your brick seeker way. That's the UPC on the harness. The harnesses are in clearance for $5 right now. So let's hook this up. Buddy. Are we in? I don't know. Okay, I think we're in. And let's see how bright this light is. So there's a... Uh, let's get the negative on first because it's a tighter one. And... Oh, I don't have the light switch on. Third. Let's change the light switch to on. And you hear the relay going off. So that's. Uh, let's go over here. Let's turn it on down there. So, it's pretty bright, right? What do you say it was? 950 lumens? 950 lumens? Yeah. Yeah, so it's pretty good. This is this is solid metal. It appears to be sealed. But I could see a gap right there. I could see a whole gap right there. And I can move that in and out, so that's not completely sealed. If you want this to be completely sealed, you're going to have to jam some RTV in there. You know, thumb some RTV into that if you want that totally sealed. I don't know what that is down in there. Let's zoom into that. I don't think that's an Allen wrench. I don't know what the hell it is, but it seems to be glued. I don't know what that is. <clears throat> I mean, things can't be totally sealed because this had to be in there somehow. I could see down in the gaps down in there where it looks like glue. So it looks like this front was glued in. So maybe that's how it's sealed. I could see. I mean, I think the camera is showing it too. You'll see. You see the reflections down in there. That's a clear glue. Unless it's the side of this. But it looks like a... I don't know. To me, it looks like it's a glue. It looks like this was epoxied in, into place. Because, see, there's no... There's no area on this thing where you could just take this apart. Maybe that's an Allen wrench. It doesn't look like one. We just zoomed into it. It doesn't look like an Allen So I don't know what that is. So anyway, that's these lights. <clears throat> now we could take this DT connector off. Uh, look at that. So these these are pretty bright. They'll be pretty damn good as um, fog lights. Um, Nine dollars.
Uh -huh. I'm getting dizzy. <laughs> You're like a racehorse. Get your tongue out. Uh, where'd you go? Uh. -huh. Oh man, I'm gonna puke on you. <laughs> I'm gonna throw up. Uh, 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 u